music is everything in a lot of ways. Uh, it, it's a part of me, and it's cliche or cheesy, but nothing else in the world makes as much sense as music to me. It is deeply ingrained and it has been for years and I don't see it going away anytime soon. It both gives me a lot of purpose and also in many times has been a life raft. It's about reaching out to thousands, millions potentially of people that I've never met before and feeling something feeling a connection just one it's such a little thing but it's the biggest thing it's more important than anything truth be told I'm not one of those people who you know locks myself in a room and writes for hours on end uh, I'm one of those people that I strike when the iron's hot say I'll get some music back from my band we'll be working on a song like recently this is the case we've been working on music and I'll take these songs home and I'll sit down and just, it just starts pouring out. Through the Keepsakes music, I tend to focus on internal struggles that not only I face, but most of the people who I interact with have faced. Um, topics like depression, anxiety, um, losing a loved one, a friendship ending, anything like that, anything that about the human experience that could be painful or traumatic, traumatic or frustrating, are the things I tend to write about. Just because I, I feel like I can be the most honest and I write what I know. And sometimes, sometimes all you need is, is to know someone else understands you. I'm honestly really grateful to be in the Georgia music community. Um, it's really booming right now, and I'm really so proud of so many of my friends and and the bands that I've watched and see grow over the years. And it's really it's such a melting pot of different kind of people and music right now. And I'm lucky to be a part of it. And I've really been welcomed with open arms from a lot of people, um, and it's a beautiful thing. And that's a, that's something else I really promote with our band and our show. I really want to be inclusive. Um, you know, I want people in the LGBTQ community to feel comfortable. I want POCs to feel comfortable. I want more of that at our shows and at shows in general and people to come out and feel at home and feel like it's a family and that it needs to be a safe space for you to be you and enjoy yourself and just let loose. I try to use my position to be positive, even some of the things I, even some of the things I say aren't positive, uh, because no one's going to be happy all the time. No one's going to be positive all the time. But I try to take any negative energy that I've been feeling, any any of my anxiety or depressive spells, anything like that, and I try to turn it into something worth listening to, and whether people can connect to that relatable way or if I can tell them that it gets better to, to hold on and that helps. Whenever I doubt myself, I always just ask myself if I would be better off without it, music and doing it. And the answer is always no. Um, it's something that I, it's in, it's, it's in me in such a way that I, I can't, I can't imagine not doing it. Um, it's, it's the only thing that makes sense to me. It's natural and it's always there for me.